Hey guys, what's up? It's OK Matty Ice, and today we are starting a new game. Uh, normally, we're seven days to die, like all the time here, occasionally Phasmophobia, but I saw this game and it kind of called out to me. Reminiscent of Quake, uh, <clears throat> Unreal Tournament, Tribes, Duke Nukem, Doom, it's all in there. We have the first person shooter, H-R-O-T, or ROT, however you want to say that. Not sure what it stands for, but this is made by a single developer, so kind of in the same vein as Phasmophobia. And it takes place in kind of like calm block Czechoslovakia in 1986. Coincidentally, you know, year I was born. So um, very kind of gray, brown, dark tones to this game, as you can see from this splash screen. And it's a first person shooter. From what I understand, I think this is the first episode. So it is going to be episodic, kind of like Doom and you know, Wolfenstein, Duke Nukem War. So I'm really excited to try it out. Look at this, I love that, it looks so cool. There is an endless campaign too, uh, I think, or endless mode I should say, where you just fight an endless wave of enemies it sounds like. Let's go to campaign, uh, let's uh, do a new one, and it's called Kiss Me Gustav, okay. And uh, you know, we're not gonna go very easy, easy, no, I, I'm new to this so, Let's just start on normal, and let's see how it goes. Ooh, wow. So as soon as I clicked, we were into the game. That was it. <laughs> I mean, there was no delay. You're right into it. And as you can see, we are on early access version 2, uh, 0.2.9. So um, let's see if it's good. I like the look of that Markov-style pistol right there. That's, you know... I've shot quite a few guns in my days, and I think that's, uh, you know, one of the kind of most interesting of that era. Okay, Cosmonaut Station. Nothing behind us. Um, e is used. I wonder if there'll be, like, secret little passageways. Ooh. That's a fan. The ultimate duty and honor of every citizen is to defend the homeland and its socialist establishment. Well, that's what, that's what some people would say. Alright, let's um, jump. Man, it's it's like you're on ice skates. It reminds me a lot of like Quake and kind of like everything that that game had. I don't know what that did, but I just did it. Man, this is very dark, very... Not bad. Oh, you can't reload? Push an R for reload, maybe it's a different button. F for flashlight. Oh, cool. Man, I tell you, that's something that they did not have in Doom, Duke Nukem, Quake, fire physics like that, my god. Those look better than, like, seven days to die, actually. Alright, turn off for flashlight. What do we got now? Ooh, we got a shotgun. Ooh. Man, I might have my uh, DPS set a little bit too high for this game. Too slow. That feels a little bit better. Felt like we were a little bit too quick on that. Okay. Um, we can mouse wheel for gun selection. Stories opens elsewhere. Okay. Took a little bit of damage there. Not a ton. Anything in here? Got some shotgun shells. That looks like it can probably be broken open. Um, they don't really tell you it much. Oh, there. I was just going to see if I could cycle to something else, but I guess I just wasted that. Hmm. Shoot the electrical panel. Observation tower. Ah, electrical. There we go. Oh, those don't look good. Jesus. Nice little meat chunks come out of them. Well, the aiming is very precise. Everything feels very fluid. Okay, so you do have to reload, but you can't manually control it? It looks like when you want to reload, it's just, you know... Hey, too bad, you're going to reload now. Which could be annoying. Hmm. 
I don't know what that is, but I want it. Can of blood and fat. Okay. That's that's different. Okay. Let's keep going. Ooh, I got a landmine. I don't know what that does, but that looks cool. Is there anything I can blow up in here? Doesn't look like it. Let's go in here real quick. Oh, it's a nesting doll. Okay, that's uh, different. <laughs> I don't know what the point of that is. There we go, some oh, rockets. We're gonna be getting a rocket launcher. Okay, let's go back here and let's uh, try and blow up that wall. I think we can probably do that. Oh, shoot, that was a... That was a grenade. Not a... Uh... Alright. Can I, you, like, shoot these and blow them up? Is that gonna work? Hey, there we go. See, I played some games in my day. Secret found. Cool. So there's secrets in this game, just like there were in you know, all those other great shooters. Ooh, I got a sickle? Oh my god, that thing is sweet! Oh, a submachine gun. Awesome. I'm already loving the look and the feel of these. Look at this. That sickle is so good. It took two shots from the Markov to, you know, kill those other things, but it only took one hit from a stupid sickle to put it down. Man, this thing's vicious. So, these all look like they take their own ammo. I don't want to waste this if I'm not going to have a lot of ammo for it. Should we go up here first? No, I feel like this is the way to go. I want to go over here, because this is probably not going to connect back to anything else. There we go. These are pro player strats right here. Ooh, man, that thing's satisfying. It has a good feel to it and a good fire rate. That is good. I like that. Alright, let's switch to the shotgun for a little while. You know, let's go to the markup. Nah, I lied. Alright, found more bullets for this. Very satisfying shooting, I must say. It is very good. I, I like it. It's very tight feeling. Very, very entertaining so far. Alright, that's where we came in. Okay. So we just made a complete circle. Store opens elsewhere. Need a rusted key. Huh. Ooh. See, that's that's what I don't like about That's what I don't like about not being able to reload. I mean this is gonna be like Strafe City. I feel like I'm wasting a whole bunch of ammo. Switch to the shotgun for a little bit. Maybe we'll be. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> that freaking dog came out of nowhere. My god. Freaking German Shepherd just blowing me up. Hey, I got some blood and fat. Cool. I was gonna say, can I break any of this stuff? Cool. So you can break stuff. I love the pixelated look of this game, though. It is so cool. I should probably try and kill some stuff. Flush. Hey, look at that. They even animated a little bit of water physics in there. How cool. Okay, we got the rusted key. That means we can open that one door now, I believe. Make sure no one's... That wasn't open before, was it? No, it was. That's right. Sure, no one's waiting for us. I don't know. The on normal, it doesn't seem like the physics are too uh, refined. What is that? Looks like a you know a water seltzer gun. <laughs> Let me just guess the <laughs> picture. <laughs> That's good. I'm having a lot of fun with this game, if you can't tell. Map of water solutions and water lines, okay. That looks like a... Suspicious. Okay. I don't know if I should turn... Ooh, we got a metal. Huh, whatever that does. We 
cut up the body. Ooh, we can. Oh man, all that's left is a face mask. Can we cut off the face mask, maybe? No. They look like plague doctors, almost, which is pretty cool. I wonder if we can break that. Oh, we can. We can break the picture. Alright, there's nothing there. Oh. I don't know what that did. Uh-oh. That dude looks a little bit angry. Did he throw a grenade at me? Dang. Where'd he go? Did I kill him? Hmm. That guy was a little bit tougher. He took quite a few shots. I don't know. That made me a little nervous. Maybe I'm moving a bit too fast. Whoa! Okay, that was an elevator. Switch to the shotgun. I feel like we're gonna run to another dog or something. Alright, let's go long range, boys. Oh yeah, if he's tossing out those, I'm not getting close to him. Man, we're almost out of ammo there. Let's get the shotgun out. Oh, we got him. Cool. We got an angry boy up here. Oh, man. Those are satisfying. Those are some of the most satisfying, like, grenades I've used in a long time in the video game. Usually grenades are just kind of, you know, like, blah when you use them. Probably don't want to get hit by the train, I imagine. Ooh, shoot. Man, I love the pace of this game. It's it's very fast. Adrenaline keeps going. Looks like we don't want to get hit by those things, whatever they are. They're grenades. That's what they are. Alright. So the enemies aren't too terribly tough on normal mode. Um, I probably should have played on hard. Because uh, I'm kind of just flying through this right now. Oh, the hand can. Oh, we got a nice little, uh, like, security cam. That could have... Oh, hey, we're going to be going outside. Very cool. Man, this is what all those rockets were for. Let's see, anything back here? Hey, we can go over 100%. That's pretty cool, too. Man, I'm nervous to go down there. Let's save real quick, wait till the train goes by, and then see what's down here. <laughs> I had to try it, but uh, that makes sense, don't walk on railroads. So... I'm still alive. I'm still, like, looking around. Okay, I guess that just loaded me into my last save point, but that was weird. <laughs> so we don't want to walk on the railways noted. Okay, let's uh, keep this out and we'll use this the next time we encounter Silver Key. Okay. Metro, result of Czechoslovak Soviet cooperation. Okay, definitely a uh, communist error. Okay, that's the way outside. We need a gold key. Okay. Is that anything? Can I use... No? Okay. Keep the hand cannon for our next set of enemies we see. Uh-oh. Okay. Oh, that's a secret. I wonder if we can use this to blow that up. We can. It's, it's nice. It's not as satisfying as... Um, I thought it would be. Hey, some stuff. I don't know what those were, but we found them. Wrap sanitary... Oh, nasty. I just love that you can just break everything. Hey! I did... I have no idea what I'm doing, and I'm literally, like, stumbling upon stuff. That is crazy. 
I'm just goofing around right now, trying to have fun. Okay. We're gonna go sickle in here. Anyone want some? No? Nope, nothing. What's in here? Nothing, that was just back in there. Okay. So we got the silver key. That was uh, right here. I love how it loops you back in. You know how they kind of do that in shooters nowadays? Like, back in the day, a lot of backtracking involved in video games. Okay, I stopped moving and he has the hammer and the sickle. That's awesome. But uh, they kind of just put you right where you need to be. That's a great feature. I love it. I want to go find someone and sickle them real quick. See how effective it is. That's pretty good. Two hits. Oh, shoot. Not on that guy. Okay, let's get up here. Ooh. And those explosive physics are no joke. Sounds like he's still walking. Ooh, and he's on fire, too. And you can shoot through the floors, that's for sure. Man, I took a lot of hits there. That wasn't cool. Ooh, we got a backpack? I don't know what that did, but maybe we can hoard... Like, hoard, yeah. Maybe we can hold more ammo now. Okay, we got plenty of Markov. There's the gold key. Ooh, shoot. Ooh, man. We just barbecued that dude. That was that was satisfying. Uh, the rocket launcher's good. Very good. Anything over here to be aware of? I don't know what that did, but... Apparently, uh, we blew something up. Uh, no secrets there. I'm trying to keep my eyes open from secrets to see if there's... Oh, nice. That was cool. I love the fire in this game. That is so nicely done. Okay. What did that do? Anything? I'm just doing stuff and hoping something happens. Alright. Here's where the gold key goes. I don't know what that thing does, but... Oh, there's going to be a fight out here. You know it. Um, let's save that ammo. Let's go with this boy. There seems to be plenty of this around. Man. All of a sudden, I can't hit anything. There we go. so dark and dreary. Oh man, it got me. Oh, they can they hit each other with those. That's kind of cool. It's one thing I miss about Doom when they would shoot each other. Okay. Almost out of that ammo. Let's switch to shotgun for now. Probably not the best outdoors, but I'll take it. There we go. Put him down pretty easily. Nice. All this weird equipment around. I don't see any secrets. Or at least anything that I would think is a secret. Okay. Go down here. Opens elsewhere. I don't know what that is. Not quite sure what this place is. Oh, hey, it's pool. Or at least something that looks like pool. Hey, we can play a little bit. Yeah, I got some time. I'm not doing anything. Hey, look at that. Cool. Uh, let's line up our shot. Yeah, 
Yeah, you just push use on it. You don't have to hit it or anything. That's pretty cool. I love when they include stuff like this in the game. That makes it so much better. Whoop. Well, I guess I scratched, so... Beer is out. I don't know what that means. Done. Sit down, bud. Can I use the beer? I can't. I can go in here wherever this goes. Oh, shoot. Got him. Then you can get trapped real easy. Oh. Okay. Well, um... I was kind of disappointed that was short, but... It was a lot of fun. Okay. Um, do, I think uh, you just go on to the next episode, yeah. This one's called Luna, or I guess the next level in the episode. Alright guys, I am going to um, save my game there. Uh, let me know what you thought of this game. Uh, it's new early access, it just came out a couple weeks ago, and it's a kind of gritty, classic first person shooter. Very brown and gray in tone, so it's uh, very dark ominous palette which is honestly surprising and I really 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 had a lot of fun playing this uh, the shooting is top-notch spot-on they got that old-school uh, you're on ice skates kind of feel and the gunplay feels good enemies uh, we only saw the th or four types I should say we saw rats we saw dogs we saw the skinny guys that have the masks and then we saw the bigger guys that throw the grenades too so Lots of cool stuff, and I know there's more to dig into here. Let me know if you guys like this type of game. I would love to play something like this on the channel every now and then to give us a break from Seven Days to Die and Phasmophobia and other games I might try. I'm also thinking about trying off um, the Shipbreaker one. I think it's called like Hard Space or something like that, where you uh, break ships and you salvage them. So if you guys would be interested in that, let me know. Leave a comment below. And we are going to leave it off right there. So as always, have a good night.